Hey, what's up everyone? It's Spirit Messenger back with another video for you in the Resident Evil 4 Remake. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to complete the challenge in tune with the Harpoon. Now, this particular challenge requires you to defeat the Lake Monster without missing any of your Harpoon shots. Now, um, this first part right here is pretty easy because he's not moving too much. He's kind of kind of still uh, But after you hit him a few times, that's when he's gonna go underwater. So you're gonna want to Kind of ride out this first part right here. Don't throw any more harpoons Let him Let him go in and out of the water And on this first part right here, he's gonna come to a stop All right. I'm just going to wait for him to open up his mouth. Think you can swallow me whole, huh? All right, here he comes. Boom, there you go. All right. So far, we haven't missed any of our shots. All right. Now that we passed that first phase of the battle, the second phase is when he starts uh, he starts going in and out of the water more, so you got to time these shots even more carefully. There you go. God, I hate when he does that. Yeah, this actually takes a lot of a lot of time and a lot of patience cuz cuz after that first phase of the battle, he uh he really really likes to make it hard on you. And this actually took me a few tries. Boom, there you go, another shot. This actually took me a few tries. This is uh, uh, probably one of the harder challenges that the game has to offer. Obviously not the hardest, but it's definitely one of the hardest. Ooh, I actually, I almost missed that one. And you never know how long he's going to stay above water. Sometimes it's just for a split second. Just like that. And he goes right back under. Other times you got... You got maybe a good few seconds when he's up above to throw your harpoon at him. But even then it's a little... It's a little risky. There we go. Alright, we're stopped again. Gonna be a little bit closer this time. Where'd you go? All right, now he's going to be a little bit more aggressive. And this is probably the part where I fail the most. Because now after he's throwing harpoons in his mouth for the second time, he's, he's not playing around anymore. So timing these shots right here on this third phase of the battle is even more, even more tricky.
Oh, I totally forgot to dodge him. And a lot of the reason why this video is so long is because it was this this part right here. How long it took me to even just get one shot at him with the harpoon. Oh, and uh, another tip too. It's not a huge tip, but it is a tip. Um, the other thing you want to keep in mind is... Uh, if you are doing this challenge, it, it may take you one try. It may take you, uh, it may take you quite a few, like it, like it took me. Um, but another uh, slight tip for you is that if you are trying to get this and you do happen to miss a harpoon, your last auto save should be where you uh, are getting on the boat. So you, uh, as soon as as soon as you're getting on the boat and going into the lake, it should start you at the beginning of the battle. Um, of course, uh, for whatever reason, if you are doing this on professional difficulty, remember there is no auto save on that difficulty. So if you are doing this on there, make sure you do a hard save um, at, at the nearest save station. So that way you can come back uh, to this spot right away so you can restart the battle. Yeah, once again, I apologize. A lot of this uh, other half of the uh, of the video is me just literally, literally waiting for me to get an open shot at this guy. Because uh, after the first few times of failing, it was pretty frustrating. So I was extra patient, extra careful. Alrighty, stopped yet again. Alright, we're waiting. We're waiting. There he is. You know, now that I think about it, after I was uh, going through the motions with this battle, I wonder... Well, no, that wouldn't make sense. I think you do have to, you know, eventually keep hitting him. Otherwise, he's just going to keep... Uh, he's just going to keep thrashing you around everywhere. But my thought was, was uh, after a while, I wonder if you could just ride it out. And after a while, uh, you know, you'll stop again, you'll get a good shot, and then... Uh, keep doing that, but I don't think you can. At least I haven't tried it. I, I, I kept throwing my harpoons at him while he was, uh, you know, throwing me around. Or at least when I had a shot, I did. So, if someone's willing to try, you know, maybe when you get to this portion of the battle, you just kind of wait it out and see. But it might be a long, it might be a long, long wait. stopping yet again.
All right, at this point, he should he should be ready to go down. And I, I totally could have dodged that, and I, I literally let him attack me like that. This should be the last stop. All right, finally. Jeez. Yeah, this particular challenge can can take a while. Um, well, at least for me it did. It, it took a while because in my other playthroughs I was just throwing harpoons at them left and right. And uh, But obviously for this challenge you can't do that. <laughs> you gotta, gotta wait it out. You gotta be patient. And I'll show you guys here. The challenge is now complete. And there it is, in tune with the harpoon. Thank you all so much for taking the time to watch this. I know it was a long video. I know it's a lot of uh, uh, sitting and, and waiting to, to get it at the right moment. But uh, there you go. Thank, once again, thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to check out my channel. Like and subscribe. I hope this video helped you guys. Thank you all so much again for watching. And I'll see you all next time.